what is happening? We are about to get exclusive access to the craziest new BMW concept car. This is how special this exclusive is. BMW has arranged for this car to be dropped off here in the real world for the very first time. And for that reason, they've got three bodyguards protecting it right now. We've got two over there. Sicherheit. This guy down here on the steps already telling someone to go away. <laughs> and there's another one just over here as well. So three bodyguards just so that we can see this car. This is a world's first exclusive right here on the Supercar Blondie channel. Make sure to subscribe. All right. <laughs> Okay, let me take you around. I want to start at the front because we've seen the back as it offloaded. This is like fluoro orange, but it's actually called Trilling Orange. And then the silver is called Cast Silver Metallic. So you've got that real juxtaposition between the silver and the orange, which is crazy cool. Here on the front, you see on the grill here, these little round circles here actually are the BMW badge. So what they've done is they've taken three of their previous models, the i8, the M1, and the BMW Turbo, and they've kind of made this car reminiscent of all three of those models. So the color, this bright orange, comes from the Turbo. These three slats here on the M1 used to be open, but now they're closed, but they have that kind of same design feature. You see this beautiful line where that kind of cuts off from silver to orange. That to me looks like an i8. And I used to own an i8, absolutely love that car. I quite like that design feature that they've taken from the car. These rims, so you've got 22 inch in the back and 21 inch in the front. When you look at concept cars, a lot of them are autonomous and a lot of them feature on that kind of autonomous aspect. This is just drivable it will not be autonomous. So what they want to do is they want to appeal to people like you and me who don't want to give up driving in the future. We still want to drive because we love it so much. So, so this is designed for the drivers of the future. Okay, so it's got kind of a, a very sporty element to it. Just press this and it kind of comes over and then you manually open it like that and you've got i8 doors, which I love. All right, let's get in. This is kind of welcomes you into the car, this BMW logo, it lights up in the center. You press this one, these first displays appear. These are the driving modes here. And then if you press this button here, this display here will light up. Now what is super, super cool is look at this. Can you read what that says? It says heart rate. And then you see here, your heart rate. You put your hands on the steering wheel as you're driving and it will read how fast your heart is pumping. It's basically like being on an elliptical at the gym, right? And it reads the heart rate through your fingertips. It's pumping really hard right now for some reason. <laughs> well, I am just in the coolest concept car that's just been released, so that's no surprise. If this all lights up, then it tells you that you can actually use the boost function. All you need to do is push down on these two buttons and it's going to grab as much energy from the batteries as possible and drive you forward. And this one. So you gotta press them at the same time, like this. These are actually cup holders. Some of this stuff, I have to be real with you guys, it can actually work, but in this car it's concept only, but what they're going for is a gyroscopic cup holder. Have you ever heard of that before? If you had your Coke in here, right? Whatever, you've been through McDonald's, you put your Coke in here. It's not going to 
tip over because this gyroscope constantly moves to balance the liquid in the glass or in your bottle so it does not tip over into the car which is quite cool i've never really thought of that concept before i really like how they're kind of pushing the boundaries and thinking of things that you don't even know that you need like how cool would that be what I'm sitting on here is not actually a seat. This is the top that I'm sitting on, but what they've done to make it super comfy is put this uh, memory foam. So what that does is it molds around your body so that it makes you feel even more comfortable in the seat. It remembers the shape of your body, which is quite cool. This latch over here as well. So you just grab this and you close it with this latch. And then this just has a bit of a magnet in there so you can just push that up. They don't have a lot of leather in this car and that's for a purpose. They're trying to reduce the amount of leather that they use in cars in future. This steering wheel is leather and the only other thing that's leather in the interior is this slash here. Everything else is more sustainable kind of materials. This carbon fiber is actually recycled carbon fiber. Um, these headrests, if you take a look at the shape here, they're kind of like, I don't know, they're, I just, I don't know, I just really like the design kind of like floating oh, oh wow <laughs> that is service thank you very much so there's quite a big um sill to get over here yeah look it's quite wide but i'm quite used to that because of my old i8 so you just got to kind of <laughs> hop over it and try and be elegant about it <laughs> it's your moment your moment to shine okay, we're going to take it for a bit of a drive christian 600 yeah, well, ps huh, bitte. Good. Turn, du schaust, was passiert. Okay. Okay, ready. Okay, let's go. Now we're gonna go and arrive in style at the BMW next gen party, this car. Let's go party. The cool thing about this car is the sounds of the car have been composed by none other than Hans Zimmer. Now you guys, would know this name because he is an incredible composer for the movies, right? He's composed music for The Lion King, Batman, Superman, Rain Man, Pirates of the Caribbean, literally so many incredible movies he has done the composition to. So we're going to go and talk to him right now um, about what he has actually composed for this BMW. Now that we move into electric cars in the future, they've actually got to be start thinking about how cars of the future are going to sound and that's where he comes into it. Believe it or not, I have watched. Oh, right, brilliant. so I know how you nice do it. Nice to meet you. Alex, Pleasure. thank yeah, you very hi, much for joining Hans. us. And this is uh, Supercar Blondie family. Right, hi Supercar Blondie family. <laughs> we just wanted to chat to you a little bit. I know you've right. had a lot to say already about your composition for the new BMW. You might have to repeat a couple of those things. All right, go on then, All ask right. me. Okay. Anything. It's actually quite interesting. I was just saying that, you know, the cars up until now, the orchestra has been the engine. Right, exactly. Yeah. So now looking to electric cars, we have to think of some other sounds that are going to entice people because electric cars, some people say, you know, no sound is boring. Well, I, I sort of, I, I sort of agree it's, not, it's boring, but at the same time, I think we finally have a chance to go and customize ourselves. We finally have a chance to get other artists in or to, you know, to, to personalize yeah, the, whole ex, the whole driving experience even more and to really make it your own. You know, plus 
in a funny way, I mean, one of the things which I always thought was really interesting is what was the world like before we had the combustion engine? Yeah. Or what did it sound like? True. And so now we suddenly get this moment where we have a clean slate and we can go and build a new sonic world. You can do anything yeah. from here on in. And that actually brings me to my next point. How in the world <laughs> do you come up with sounds out of nowhere? I mean, where are the, what's your inspiration for these particular sounds? You know, well, obviously part of it is, is, is the visual of the iconic design, you know. Uh, but it's, this is the funny thing, you know, I grew up with hearing sounds in my head. Mm. You know, it's, I mean, what well, I said earlier, it's like, it's, it's this weird thing, you know, here's this German in Munich speaking in English, his second language, but really the language I'm most articulate in is of course music, which right. is some weird abstract thing. Right. Uh, and it's hard to communicate that to everyone else who no, doesn't because, communicate because in music. You no, know? you just go and play it and it either it moves you or it doesn't move right. you and either you know and, and, and that's part of the so, for example, the Lion King, right? When we watch that, oh, we that are, one. we just, well, I mean, I cry. Never heard of I mean, <laughs> you know, that tiny little movie yeah. that literally everyone in yeah. the world has seen. You, you cry, you're moved by it. Is that kind of what you're trying to do with even car sounds? Is get people to be moved by just the sound of, I don't know, a door opening? A little bit. I'm trying to make, you know, I'm trying to make your life better. I, and that, that can mean many things, you know. Can it be more exciting or can it be more peaceful? I mean, you know, somebody, somebody today said, you know, well, what's it going to be like when you go, you know, a uh, hundred miles an hour and the wind noise? And I said, anyway, oh, hang on a second. It's, this is a great thing because we can get rid of the wind noise and, and it's so easy. True. You know, the ideas keep coming because we get, you know, the, the great thing about the electric cars is mm. it's, a, it's a blank canvas for yeah. us. So we can do whatever we want. So what did you, what sounds did you actually do for this new BMW? All because it's a very iconic and it's a very, you know, striking car. Mm. Um, you know, we did, I'm not sure how many I'm supposed okay. to allow to tell you, but we, 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 we did, you know, like, I, I wanted something great when you just switch the thing on. Just yeah. something that was, n that was not going to be a car. It wasn't going to be a normal average day. Okay. You know, so, so, you know, that was, uh, again. You have, so like you know, what? I, I can't just, you know, how <laughs> am I going to describe it? You know, what, what's life like, you know, when you get up in the morning yeah. and you go down to your car and wouldn't it be great if it was just the greatest chord you ever heard that just greets you in the morning? Yeah, and send, it can you know, change your mood instantly, absolutely. right? Absolutely. So, so do that, you know, maybe make the world a slightly happier place. There's nothing wrong with that, right? No, yeah. There are so many times now that we do not have a full music experience. We no. have tiny little speakers yeah, yeah. from our iPhone, yeah. and that's kind yeah. of, it's yeah. only the movie, the right. cinema now, and cars, yeah. where you get yeah. that kind of all encapsulated experience, where you're kind of all enclosed in one room, so you can fully get that. That's really cool, right. yeah. So you're going to be working more and more on car sounds then in the future, Yeah, no, it's, a, it's just, you know, it's just another part of my sort of yeah. crazy journey, my own life. It is you know? crazy. Oh, let's go and do this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's do the line. I am literally. I was literally working on the line, the new version of the line. Oh thing, yeah. Why you know? I haven't sleep. seen it yet. I can't oh, wait. It's not out yet. Yeah. You can't go, wait. Yes. G give us another couple of yeah, weeks. Yeah. Yeah. But um, you know, I was doing that, and at side the same time, side. yeah, side by side. So, um, and and both of them, again, you know, it's hard to describe. Yeah. But you're trying to you're trying to make an experience. Totally get it. Totally get it. It's a pleasure. Brilliant. Cheers. And I can't wait to hear the sounds then. Okay. I hope you like them. But you I see, here's know. the great thing. Yeah. If you don't, we can change them. Yeah, you that's try true. To you try to do that to a V8. Yeah, that's right. true, right? You buy yeah. the car and right. that's the sound yeah, you get. Yeah, you're stuck with it. That's very yeah. true. Yeah, good insight. Cool, yeah. thank you so, so much. Thank Appreciate you. it. We'll see you tonight at the party, yeah? yeah? Perfect. Do you have a photo of you guys? Oh, yeah. Did you do? Okay. Is it Polaroid, actually? Oh, brilliant. Oh, Polaroid. I'll be going back in time. I love it. <laughs> Thank you very much for subscribing. If you haven't yet, just click that button. You're going to see the coolest cars in the world, I promise you. And a big thank you to my Supercar Blondie family. Give us a quick like. And for now, we're out. Christian, you subscribe to my YouTube channel? Okay. <laughs> of course. Do what he did, guys. <laughs> All right.